Governments plan to debate the Tourism and Development Corporation bill today being thrown out the window following criticisms from the Bahamas Vacation Rentals Association who argue that government failed to consult them before moving forward with the bill. While the association's interim president declined to speak with Eyewitness News on record, an email was sent revealing that the bill, which was expected to be debated in Parliament today, lacks the support of the hundreds of vacation rental hosts. And it's against this backdrop that the bill was set aside for a debate today. And according to opposition leader of business in the lower chamber, Adrian White, all sides must be on the same page. It's such an important uh, product, the tourism industry, which is our, our main economic driver. Uh, the both sides of the house want to ensure that any legislation that comes through is uh, passed and receive proper consultation. Meanwhile, the association's interim president added that a premature debate of the bill could result in quotes rooms being pulled off the market at a time when there is a shortage of rooms for tourists visiting our country. Close quote. I think we agree with the government on this right now that if there are stakeholders that have not uh, been consulted, then they should be and uh, hopefully uh, we'll get this back before the House very soon and get it right for the people. Now, this is not the first time government has faced backlash for not consulting with stakeholders on various national issues, and it's an issue that the opposition leader, Michael Pintard, says needs to be addressed. Yeah, one of the matters we intended to raise in this debate was the lack of consultation because already we, we were aware that that several groups were concerned and this is a pattern of behavior by this administration failure to consult on important pieces of legislation jose atien eyewitness news